Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I am finally doing a what I got for Christmas haul. I posted a poll a couple days ago and asked you guys which video you wanted to see and this one won. So I'm finally sitting down and going through everything I got. So if you guys are interested, just keep on watching. I'm filming this because this is what you guys said you wanted to see in the poll, so that is what we are doing. In no way am I trying to brag and I just want to put that out there. I know I'm pretty fortunate when it comes to Christmas and everything like that. And I know there are people that are less fortunate and more fortunate than me. So just want to throw that in there. But yeah, let's get into it. So I feel like I should also add that my parents are divorced. So I basically have four Christmases, if that makes sense. Like I do Christmas Eve with my mom. I do Christmas Day with my dad and his mom. So my grandparents on my dad's side. And then the day after Christmas, I do my grandmother on my mom's side. So basically I do Christmas around four times. So just figured I should throw that in there. So I basically just have everything laid out and there's no really like rhyme or reason to how I'm gonna go through these. So I'm just gonna start with what's in front of me. So first I got these like sweatpants and they're from Target. And my brother got a job there maybe like a month ago. So they're super, super comfy. They have really stretchy, super soft. He said they're a Target favorite. So I got these, they're like a dark gray. Absolutely love them. Me and my sister both got a pair. They're so comfortable. And they have pockets, which I just figured that out today. Next is this little bralette from Aerie. So super cute, I love the color. I think it's perfect for like the fall and winter. Now a couple sweatshirts. My first one is this one. And I found this online one day. I don't really know where it's from, but I'm a huge Office fan. If you guys watched my video from last year, I got an Office blanket. That was super cute. So I absolutely love this one. It says Shroot Farms bed and breakfast so i thought that was really cute and then this sweatshirt i wanted for forever so i was super happy when i opened it and it's really just a james madison university sweatshirt which i feel like i have a million of these by now but it's a large so it's super big super comfy and it's really thick so it keeps me really warm next is my hydro flask i finally got one of these i feel like i have so many water bottles but i also feel like i can never have enough so I got one of these. I went out today and got a straw lid for it as well. So I'm super excited to clean this and finally use it. Next are these behind the ear warmers. So you like basically put them back here and they go over your ears and keep them warm. Um, they're super soft. I can feel them like through the packaging. So I'm actually really excited to use these because for all of you guys that don't know, I'm in college and my college is in the mountains. So it gets really, really cold. Um, so these are really gonna come in handy for me. Next, I got these two sets of pens slash markers. This one is double-sided and these are just fine tip pens. So nice when I start taking notes for college. Then I got these really warm socks that have like the grips on the bottom. So they double as like slippers. So these are gonna be warm as well. Next is my JBL Flip 5 speaker. I actually had a Bose Microlink speaker a while ago and um, I lost it. <laughs> I don't know where it went. I was traveling from college to my house and um, it disappeared. I have no idea. It's not in my house. It's not at college. It's not my car. I literally have no idea what I do with it. So I asked for a new speaker. So I'm super excited about these. Both my siblings have one. So I'm super thankful to have a speaker again. Next is some jewelry. So first I got this opal bracelet. So it looks like this. It's adjustable. It's super, super pretty. I think opals are so pretty, I love it. Next is this necklace from Kendra Scott. And it looks like this with some diamonds, super, super pretty. Next, this one might be my favorite piece of jewelry. I love this so much. And it's this butterfly necklace, if you guys can see that. And it's actually from Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again, the second movie. And it's the necklace that young Donna wears like throughout the whole movie. I was obsessed with that movie, still am, like literally my favorite movie ever. Um, so I found that on Etsy one day and I was like, oh my god, I need that in my life. So it's super pretty and I absolutely love it. Next is a Sun Bum dry shampoo and it smells so good. It smells like super tropical, like bananas. If you guys know what Sun Bum smells like, it smells like all of their products. So this is in my stocking, so I love that. Next, I'm gonna go through some of my shoes. So I got four pairs of shoes. <laughs> um, first, I have these fuzzy purple Crocs, which I'm absolutely obsessed with. They're so nice. I have, I have these Crocs. They're like, ooh, they're like cheetah print and they're like my favorite things ever. So I asked for a fuzzy pair. So obsessed. I love a good pair of Crocs. They're so nice. Next are these Steve Madden platform sandals. And I think they're so cute. Obviously can't wear them now because it's like 30 degrees outside. But I think like spring and summer, they're gonna be so cute to wear with like, honestly, even this outfit. I think it'd be so cute. 
Before I continue, let me do what I'm wearing because that was also a gift. So these earrings, I'll get into them more later, but that was a Christmas gift. And then this shirt is super soft, super comfortable. I love it. But back to shoes, I got these Steve Madden platform sneakers, which I think are so cute. They're just white and I absolutely love them. My friend Paige had a pair when she came to my house and I was like, oh my God, I absolutely love those. So I put them on my Christmas list and I got them. So that was super exciting. And last for shoes are these like little black booties. I have a pair in white that I love because they just remind me of like the 70s. So I asked for a pair in black and again, just, I love them. Going back to my earrings, I found this set on Amazon and it was basically like 40 pairs of earrings for like $15 and like that. So they just come in like sets of six. So this was on one of the sets. So that was super nice because now I feel like I have a lot of earrings to wear. Next is this pink Yeti. I absolutely love Yetis. I only have one of the like big ones. I also have a purple coffee mug that I got last year that's by Yeti. Um, but I saw this color that they came out with this year and I absolutely loved it. So yes, put that on my Christmas list. Actually has my water in it right now. Next, I got a bag of Chamberlain coffee, which I'm super excited to try. I made a cup Christmas Eve when I opened this gift. The amount of coffee things I got this Christmas is absolutely insane, but believe me, I will go through literally all of them. Next is this candle, and I think it's funny because all of us kids got one of these candles because at our beach house, this is the candle we burn. It just smells so good. So if you guys have a Publix near you, that's where you can find these. You probably can find them, honestly, probably other places too. But it's a village candle and it's the scent Tropical Getaway and it's crushed pineapple and coconut milk. So good. It smells so good. Next, these two Bath & Body Works shower gels and then one's vanilla bean and one's winter candy apple. This one, holy grail, love it. It's probably my favorite scent at Bath & Body Works, like, ever. And I also got the body cream to go with that, so that's super nice. Next, I don't really know how to explain these, but you guys might know what I'm talking about. Um, this is actually from my sister because she asked for the purple set and she got both a purple and a blue and the blue is just not her aesthetic if that's how you want to say it so she gave me the blue set and it's just these like basically i don't even know how many there's in here maybe like a hundred and they're just like little pictures and they're just really aesthetic i guess and you can just decorate your wall with it and stuff like that so she gave these to me so i'm gonna put them up at college because I'm not gonna put them up at home where I'm not gonna be. So taking these back with me. There's one picture in here that's my favorite. Oh, right here. Just so pretty. I love these. Next are these socks and they're like the no-show socks. So you can wear them with like shoes like this or Vans or stuff like that. Okay, this next gift takes some explaining. So I bought a pack of four clear mugs from Williams Sonoma last year for Christmas. I kept one, gave one to my dad one to my stepmom, and one to my mom. I'm not joking when I say these are absolutely my favorite mugs. I love these mugs so much. So at college, I have one of these mugs and then like maybe five or six other different mugs, but the clear one is the only one that I like ever go for. So I ended up having to like hand wash it every day just so I can use it the next day. I asked for another set of these mugs and they're like kind of on the pricey and I think four is around like 50-ish dollars. So I got a set of four and I'll show you guys what they look like. They just look like this. I haven't washed them yet, so like they're kind of dirty, um, but they're double like insulated. So it keeps your drink hot and your hands not hot. So super, super nice. I absolutely love these mugs. But the funny part is, is William Sonoma messed up. And so my mom, three sets of four and not just one. So um, now I have two sets and she kept the other one. So super excited. I think it was a sign because I've literally been asking her for these mugs since probably last Christmas. Now I never have to hand wash these mugs again because if I had nine mugs, these eight and the one I already had, I never have to wash a mug because they'll always be clean from the dishwasher. So super, super excited about that. That was probably one of my favorite gifts this year. And that's how you know you're getting old when you ask for stuff like that. So that's fun. Next are some clothes. This I actually bought myself, but it's pretty new. So I figured I'd include it. It's from Target and I found it on sale for like 750. So I figured why not? Um, this is what it looks like super cute um we were gonna take family pictures but ended up being too cold so i didn't wear it um but i think that dress is super cute and it was seven dollars next is a simply southern shirt that my dad got for me but if you turn it on the back it says life's about sweet tea and waffle fries and if you know me or watch my channel you guys know i've worked at chick-fil-a for like three years so 
It's a great gift. Super cute and I laughed when I opened it. So funny. Next are these high-waisted black denim jeans. I honestly think that my last pair of black jeans that I got was when I was like 15. Now I'm 19, so I needed to get a new pair. So here they are. I absolutely love high-waisted jeans and they're from American Eagle, so super excited about those. Oh, also I got another pair of jeans that are mom jeans that have like holes throughout them, but they ended up being too big, so my mom's shipping them back and getting a new size. So I also got a regular pair of jeans that are like the regular color denim. I got the Green Mountain Blueberry Coffee, which is honestly one of my favorite Keurig pods. So these are super, super fun. My Nana got me that because it's kind of like her favorite coffee and my favorite coffee. So that was really cute that she got me some for Christmas. Court, that was really good. She doesn't care. Anyways. Did she record me? I said that was really good. Oh. So for my last few gifts, one of them was a computer monitor for school because I have a MacBook and it's a little small and because everything's been online, I basically have to do all my schooling from my computer. So I got a, I think 24 or 26 inch monitor for my desk, which I'm super excited about. So that's still under the tree because I'm gonna take that back to school with me, obviously. But for my last and probably favorite gift, I have to take you guys downstairs because it doesn't belong in my room. So I'm gonna go ahead and, oh, that blinded me. So I'm gonna go ahead and take you guys downstairs with me. So this is becoming more like a vlog. Okay, let's go. Okay, so now we are down in my basement because my last and final gift that I got was a Nespresso machine and I am absolutely obsessed with it. I love it so much and I think I'm gonna save a lot of money on Starbucks by now. So basically this is a Nespresso machine and from what I understand you can make literally any type of coffee from it. Um, there are a whole bunch of different pods or capsules or whatever you want to call them and each different pod or capsule will make a different drink. So a few that I have are a double espresso shot, Fortado, which I probably am butchering all these names, a Bianco Forte, and then the green one, I think it's an Alto Intenso. So I'm still learning what all these do, have literally no idea. All I've been doing is making double shots with my lattes, but it's pretty cool. I think this is the Ventuo Next machine, um, but I'm not really sure. But when you get the machine, it comes with this basically little like sample pack of some of the pods that you can buy so if you look at the top these are like all the ones that nespresso has there's literally so many so these will make you like all regular coffee these will make you a five ounce coffee this will make you a double espresso shot and these are all like single espresso shots so these are the few that it came with i'm super excited to try them all out um i've clearly tried one of these and then a couple of the ones that i got separately so i got about four of these that i tried to fit all into this clear view which i got as well um i also got this syrup trio that i think my mom got from like tj maxx i'm pretty sure so it comes with vanilla mocha and salted caramel and then i also bought the terrani french vanilla syrup so it's really nice i really like it i'll insert a clip of me like actually making it from this morning that I filmed and showing you guys how it disposes of the capsules, which I think is pretty cool. It basically lifts it up and puts it in the back and then you empty it out from here. So if you guys have one of these, please let me know down below what type of recipes you guys like because I'm honestly still trying to figure it out and don't really know what I'm doing yet. So I'm just learning and yeah, that was probably honestly one of my favorite gifts. So super excited that i got that but that is about everything i really can't tell what this looks like so this could look really bad but that is about everything i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you liked it give it a thumbs up down below and also comment what your favorite gift was make sure to subscribe down below and also make sure to hit the little notification bell to get notified every time i upload i hope you guys had a merry christmas and a happy new year and i'll see you guys in the next one bye